This is the daily video update for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. I'm the Reverend Oscar Sinclair. Today is Tuesday, November 17th, 2020. Yesterday afternoon, I had a chance to sit down on Zoom with one of our members, Becky Sate, who's been active in the Green Sanctuary Committee at the church for a while. The Green Sanctuary Committee is doing some really exciting work around um, the city of Lincoln's climate plan, and they're going to present on that on Thursday night. And so I wanted to take some time uh, to sit down with Becky and, and uh, do a series of these daily updates um, highlighting that work that they're doing. So with that, I'll turn it over uh, to Becky. So first, um, Becky, how are you today? It's a beautiful day outside. I guess for people who are worried about climate change, maybe it's unseasonable, but I'm loving it. <laughs> so, uh, Yeah, um, we're recording this on Monday, so it's about 67 degrees outside. And if, yep. if Nebraska has gone into deep freeze three days from now when this airs, we'll... <laughs> <laughs> Well, I think it's supposed to be 72 on Thursday, so, you know, I mean, um, I'm, I'm liking every single day that we can be outside in an absolutely, you know, enjoying every minute of it, <laughs> so. No, that's fair. That's fair. So, um, one of the things that we're, we're previewing this week is that on, on Thursday night, we're going to have a chance to um, hear from the Green Sanctuary um, committee after after worship um and so we wanted to take some time to preview that uh preview that work um so uh this is kind of up to you where you want to start this but uh but what what is the green sanctuary um group up to this fall well, I think more to the point is what the city is up to, which we find pretty exciting. And of course, Green Sanctuary wants to support that and wants our congregation to support it in any way they can. So um, maybe some people are aware that L the LAS board is going to be voting on decarbonization goals. And actually, that's going to be happening this Friday. Um, they've been having uh, public input for several months on that, and they held two wonderful um virtual meetings for the public last week. I thought they were very, very well done. It seems like their goal will be 100% net uh, carbon emission reduction by 2040. Some of us wish it would be earlier, but um, you know that's great. And uh, people can still support that by emailing them and we'll talk a little bit more about it. Um, and the other piece of that is that they have sustainability programs that are not very well subscribed and some of them don't take much. So it would be wonderful if we would indicate our support right. that way. So, so we'll be covering that. 